Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a video talking about how to get a job at Maurice's. Disclaimer, just excuse the um, background. It is a little messy and I'm also playing with the lighting a little bit. So just keep that in mind. Okay, so I've been wanting to do this video for quite some time now. If you haven't watched my videos, welcome to my channel. Hi, um, you should click the subscribe button. But um, as some of you may already know, I do work at Maurice's. I've worked there for... Um, going on two years now and I actually made my way up to assistant manager so with that being said I think I have a few things to say about how to get a job at Maurice's. I've kind of seen both sides from being the person to um, be interviewed and then also interviewing the person so I have both sides of the perspective so I feel like I could give you guys some good tips. All right, so the first tip is very obvious, but it's also important, um, is to show up on time. Um, usually, even about 10 minutes early is good um, because you don't want to be late. You could just come in and say hi, like, for instance, my name is Mariah and I'm here for an interview at 3 o'clock. And then um, what we'll do is we'll get our paperwork ready and um, get ready to get you back there and sit down and do the interview. And in that time, you can just walk the store, look at all the new product and um, just get familiar with the store. So first, what we'll do is we'll come get you and... I know at my store we do a lot of training with the other managers on interviewing so it could be up to one to two people back there with you interviewing. It'll probably be like two managers. Sometimes it'll be just one but most of the time it'll be about two people that'll be in there in the interview with you interviewing you. So the first thing that I look for whenever I'm interviewing someone for a position at Maurice's is their dress. I want to know if they are fashionable because we don't really have sales associates at Maurice's. They're called stylists. Different things that a stylist would be doing is of course dressing mannequins, processing freight, dressing in the current fashion, keeping up with all the latest fashion trends, and of course making sure each and every customer that walks in gets that one-of-a-kind experience that you're not going to get anywhere else. But like I said, the first thing I look at is their fashion. What are they wearing? Are they in with the new trends that are going on? Are they wearing sweatpants? Are they wearing business attire? You just need to dress the part and that goes for anywhere that you apply to. For instance, if you're applying to American Eagle, wear American Eagle's clothes. That will impress them just like here at Maurice's. Wear Maurice's clothes. That will definitely impress and if you don't own anything from Maurice's, at least wear something that looks like it came from Maurice's. Like, I wore this. I actually got off work a couple hours ago. I wore this to work. This shirt is from Target, but it looks like something that we would sell at Maurice's because it's in style right now and it doesn't have any logo on it. The next thing I'm going to look for is how genuine and friendly are you? Are you enthusiastic and outgoing? That's exactly what we're looking for at Maurice's. We're looking for someone that is not afraid to greet customers and meet new people, make interactions, and just connect with the customer. And here's a little side tip. If you are in an interview and there's two or more people interviewing you, make sure that you talk to all of them, not just one manager that is asking you the questions. You need to connect with everybody in that room. The first things that they'll ask for is obviously how many hours are you looking for? And that all depends upon you and your Maurice's. And then they'll ask about your availability. And I'm gonna be honest with you, we usually need people who are available on the weekends and nights, just about like anywhere else though. But we are really good about working around schedules because I'm in college right now and um, a few of my other co-workers are too and they're really good about working around stuff like that. So just be open and honest with them about your out of work activities. And if you have kids or anything, be sure to tell them that. So yeah, whenever we ask, tell me about yourself, that could be anything. We wanna see if you're able to engage in a conversation with us because if you're able to do that with us, then you're able to do that with customers in real life out on the sales floor. You could talk about anything. Talk about your pets, talk about your um, school, talk about your family. Just be honest and genuine about it. Whatever you do outside of work, just talk about it. It's Just talk about it like you were talking with a couple of friends, but but leave the bad stuff out. And then we'll probably ask, again, this varies with different races, but we'll probably ask some questions regarding customer service and what would you do in certain scenario cases. Maurice's is all about the customer and making sure that they are happy and 
customer surveys are really important to us. We want to always keep those up at 100. We really want her experience while she shops at Marisa's to be the highlight of her day because it honestly could be. We don't know what our customers went through throughout the day and so coming into our store and seeing us and building her a new outfit might be the highlight of her day and we want to do that for every customer. So towards the end of the interview, they'll probably, again, I don't know if this is at every Maurice's, this is just at the one that I work at and this is um, things that I've done whenever I've interviewed people. So at the end of the interview, I'll say, okay, we're going to play a scenario where, and I'll say just a random event. And I'll say, okay, so I have a date tonight and I need an outfit and I need you to pick me out something. This kind of stuff happens in real life. Customers come into Maurice's and they'll say, hey, I need you to pick me out an outfit. I have to be ready in 10 minutes. And you got to make sure that is cute, that it's their style, that it's in their budget, and make sure it's the right size. Whenever we do this role play, I'm looking to see if they will ask me questions. You should always ask questions whenever you're working with a customer at Maurice's. You need to ask personal questions to really connect with them. So asking what they're going to do that night, where are you going to wear this outfit to, what is your style, what do you normally like to wear, even ask about the budget. Make sure you ask the questions. That will really impress them and then I'll tell them to go out onto the sales floor and um, pick out the outfit and just to take your time. And it usually only takes a couple minutes and when you pick out the outfit make sure you layer it up with jewelry, shoes, accessories. Never just pick a top and a bottom. You always want to dress the top up with maybe a bralette or a necklace and jeggings. You want to make sure you have the boots, boot socks, just all the accessories to really build up that outfit and build up that sale. And then whenever you go back to show it to your managers, you need to sell it to them. You need to talk about why you picked these pieces and how they would work with the outfit and different ways you could wear them and why you thought it'd be perfect for her date night. And then that about wraps up the interview. It usually only takes about 20 minutes. It's not that long at all. It really flies by if you're actually being genuine and making conversation and really just connecting with us and that stands out in an interview so well because if we see that you're interacting with us well you're gonna definitely be amazing out on the sales floor and you'll be showing us why you would be perfect on our team. Working at Maurice's is really awesome just from my experience. You make a lot of personal connections with your co-workers and your customers and you learn how to build outfits. Maurice's is also good if you want to move up in a company and you also get a 40% off discount. So that's amazing. So if you do get the job, we really do want you to wear Maurice's clothes. So that 40% off should definitely help you out a lot. At the beginning, when I first got hired, I didn't really have that much stuff from Maurice's. So I just got a bunch of like the basic pieces and layered them different ways until I built my wardrobe up a little bit. And now my closet is literally full of Maurice's stuff, you guys. But yeah, working at Maurice's is awesome. And if you've ever thought about applying, you definitely should. I've not had any bad experiences while working here. I absolutely love it. I love my coworkers. Hi, Shauna, if you're watching this. And that's all that really happens in the interview, you guys. It's not really hard at all. Yeah, that's my main tips, you guys. So just be friendly, genuine, all about customer service, and just show that you have that product knowledge about what's in trend right now. And I think you'll be all set. Okay, so that about wraps up this video. I'm sorry if I talked really fast. I felt like I just flew through this, but I just had so much to say, I felt like. So if you made it through the end of this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. And stay in tune for my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye, guys. It's like right now. I wish that I could say